Come on, Hattie. Forget about the fat sir. Lads, shut up. But he's a serf, and you're a countess. Uh, talking about serfs. Oh, hey, Nico. Where's Rome? <laughs> Good question. Hey, Yoko, your dumb cousin isn't here. Go get me a coffee. What? Get me a fucking coffee! Come on, I'll get you one. What? You keep staring at me. I'll burst one of your eyeballs. Gorgeous, this guy's a fucking creep. Give him a break. He's new in the country. I can see that. Did you walk here from 1985? Yeah. Excellent. Now stop fucking staring at me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but come on. Uh, hey, Mallory. Hey, man. Hey. <laughs> About time. Vlad, Vladdy boy, what's going on? Roman, Roman boy, you tell me what's going on. Nice aftershave, what is that, sex pest? No, <laughs> it's where is my fucking money? I, I had it, I, I had some of it. Then those Albanians you said you would deal with came and smashed my computer. So it's my fault? I, I didn't say that. Good. Anyway, Nico dealt with him. Broke Darden's arm, then beat up a couple more. Then we teach them a real lesson. <laughs> Is that so? I tell you what. While you don't pay, maybe you and Nico can do me few favors. Sure. <laughs> Good. Why not? Later, Vlad. What? The phone's ringing. Hey. Yeah. Okay. No, I, I can do it. My cousin will do it. Yes, he can drive. No, he's not a cop. His name is Nico. You'll be right over. Nico, sorry to ask, cousin. Can you go pick up Jermaine, one of my regulars? He's over on Rotterdam Hill on Mohawk Avenue? Whatever. What was this all about? Nico came in looking for you, and Vlad told him to get him a fucking coffee, and Nico didn't want to. Coffee? What was he thinking? I know. for coming. Can you take me over to Masterson Street? Masterson Street it is, Jermaine. Head in the right place after an evening of day. Shit, I thought Roman was gonna pick me up. I need someone I can trust for this run. I'm Roman's cousin. If you can trust him, you can trust me. Ah, uh, he told me about you. You're Nico, right? The hotshot ladies' man cruising around the Mediterranean, breaking hearts and making millions? Yeah, I traded in the yacht for this cab. <laughs> That's exactly the kind of bullshit I can imagine Roman making up. You've got to give him credit for his imagination. Yeah, you got him. I had a feeling you sounded too good to be true. The question is, are you willing to get your hands dirty? My hands haven't been clean for a long time. Being here in Liberty City is just making them dirtier. That door isn't meant to be open. Wait here while I take a look. Only on Weasel. Don't miss it. Music will set you free. Especially to you. The cops are on to me. Get us out of here. That's America. Take what you want and ride an SUV. I ain't going down, man. Get rid of this heat. Shit, man, you gotta lose these cops! All right, 
I don't think they know where we are. Don't attract any unnecessary attention. And you think you're the genius around here? Well, that's a weight off my mind. the Jingoism Act at the request of the president, saying that we must fight terrorism. So what brings you to Liberty City, Nico? Roman, I guess. And some other things. I'm looking for something. Good luck finding them. How's the hunt been going so far? It is not really started yet. I'm getting settled in, you know? Roman has had some issues with loan sharks that needed to be resolved. Okay, we're here. Thanks, man. Keep looking after Roman, all right? I got your friend Jermaine where he wanted to go. Good, Nico. Thanks, thanks. Can't talk. See you soon. I brought my kids over to take a look. Then I saw it was a body. God, I'm so stupid. I can't believe they let me breathe. Captain Philippides was in charge of the platypus, a vessel that recently docked at East Bay. The rest of the crew are currently unaccounted for. Authorities are making inquiries. More people fall unconscious to Weasel News than any other news source. This is Weasel News. Headed to town. I don't give a fuck if the bridge is busy. You're a cab driver. Hey. Hello, Roman Bellic Enterprises. Uh, no, uh, Mr. Bellic is stepped away from his office. Can I take a message? Okay, great. No, I'm not gay. Yes. I'll, <laughs> I'll tell him. Car 7, head to South Slopes. Come on. Where are you, Mohammed? Hello, Roman Bellic's up. Fucking battery, this is chaos! Capitalism is a dirty business. Yeah? Like war? Not exactly. No, maybe not. When are you going to tell me properly about what happened? I'm not going to judge you. Uh, when you got time. There, I have time. Another time. Can I help? Okay, yes. Go pick up my friend little Jacob. He's a good man. Likes to smoke a bit. Look after him. He's on Oned Avenue in South Slopes. And Nico, man, we should talk sometime. Aww. I'm a good listener. Whatever, man. Mohammed, what the fuck? Are... Oh, Miss Weinstock. No, no, not you. I, I, what can I do for you today? Brother, forward at Dillon Street in Shatla. Yo, Nako, the one man Roman been talking about all this time. Cousin Nako, gonna help Roman take over the world and thing. I guess so. Respect, all right, all right. We're going to this spot where I needed to wait for it. See? I gotta ask you another favor, too. Go for it. Can you take this piece? You hear anything bad going down? You come on help, right? Are you worried about this? I know how to use a gun if you want me to keep watch on things. Brainless, brother. You're my man Roman's cousin. Thanks, respect. This rascal that I rock is with my brethren, real bad man the other day. I want to make peace, but John know what type of shit they might pull off. All right, they be the spot up there. Watch out for any bodies. Sure.
What's this? I know there's only gonna be one of you coming. Jacob, Jacob, Jacob. We have to teach a bad man his lesson and thing. Shit, Nico, get this blood out. Watch yourself, cook on the other one on the ground. Mr. Foot, go on! Sorry for Marga Dog, Marga Dog, turn around and bite you. Come here back at home, bro, cafe. Your real creation step on Nico. Righteous with that piece. I have had much experience. I think we can do some work together, Auntie. In the future, you know? I am always looking for work. If it pays. Here's my number. I will link up to. Okay, next thing you know, they'll, they'll outlaw sleeping with underage girls. I blame the blacks and the Jews. Residents are clearly confused as to what the topic at hand is, but nevertheless, they're overflowing with ignorance. Thanks for everything. You can keep the peace. I think you know if you use it better than I and I do. One love. Hey, we Rasta. I don't need to talk. Make with me. Well, I was speaking to Al. What's up? I just want to say, communities got to take pride in what they do, man. And that's what my project is all about. My project is all about. It's like hip-hop back when we invented that shit. Before it went all commercial. Wrong. I took Jacob where he wanted to go. Driving for you ain't as boring as I thought it would be. Jacob is a good man. Watching glue dry with Jacob would not be boring. Thank you, cousin. It's blood. Well, the uh, name doesn't ring any bells. I'm sorry. You better start remembering important people, you dumb peasant. Your cousin owes me a lot of money. If you don't want to make things real difficult for him, you are going to come to Cameron's bar in Mohawk. I have a word for you. Is there something wrong with me? Uh, it's my weight, isn't it? No, 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 you're great. Nice. I'm going back to the meeting. Good. I'm going to be somebody. Yeah, yeah. See you later, Mel. You always were an asshole, Mickey. Hey, watch where you're going. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> I tried to tell you. Fuck you. you. Excuse me. <laughs> so, Ivan, I see you later, okay? Yoko, Fetty Roman's cousin. What's your name again? Big Mouth Prick. Very gracious. Sit down. Cousin uh, Nico. That's it, Nico. Not Big Mouth Prick. You funny guy. I try. Yes, and this one's. I'll let you take the shit out of me. Take the shit? Yes, me give out. I don't understand. Ah, people who fuck with me get fucked with. Okay, fine. Calm down. Whatever. Some old man not paid me in months. And I'm not the kind of person who is treated this way. Old bastard owns a china shop in the Camden Avenue in Dukes. Here you go. Don't hurt him. Just teach him a lesson. I don't need a bat to teach a lesson.
Hey, let me in. You have Vlad protection money, old man. Big Vlad and his protection money? I'm so scared. What I need protection from? You think this door is going to save your shop? There's shit I can break out here. Vlad should pay me to tell punks like you to go away. He get no money. The passes, bro. Stop fucking with me. Excuse you, man. Stop it, shit break! I pay up now! I pay up! Shit! Here! I thought Vlad and I had understanding. Only thing I understood was you owed him money. Hey, Yokel. You managed to do the job? Get Vlad his money? He paid up. I had to smash the shop up pretty good, but he paid. Don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. That it? Can I go now? Sure. Get out of my face. <laughs> <laughs> 